Hey y'all, Josh here today, AKA the world's greatest dad. And we got a couple batteries to jump. So I figured there's no better time to field test our booster pack ES5000. Let's get it. All right, kids, here's the situation. We rent this camper out on outdoorsy every once in a while. I haven't had it out yet this year, but it's going out tomorrow. So I gotta get it pulled down to my house and checked out to make sure we're good to go. One problem though, my beautiful 72 Ford Maverick Grabber is dead in the water as well as that Ford Econoline van back there. So before we can get this bad boy out here, we gotta get those things jumped and moved. Lucky for us, we've got our booster pack ES5000, and this thing is an absolute beast. This is about the fifth or sixth year I've owned it. And here's what I love about this, man. This thing's literally been sitting in a car for about four or five months. We're gonna click the status right there. You'll see it's not even fully charged. And we're gonna do a little field test today Put this on both these and see if it works. Let's go ahead and jump this Ford Econo line van first. Now, just to show you, she's dead in the water. As you can see, we got nothing. All right, let's go ahead and get it hooked up. Let's see if we got her. Here we go. Go ahead and get this thing taken off and move on to the Maverick. Let's show you this thing is dead as a doornail. Come on, baby, come on. No love. All right, let's go ahead and get this one hooked up. And as we do, I just want to point out kind of the clearance you get here is just about three feet with each one of these cables. Negative there. Positive right there. Let's see if she'll fire up. And enough about that booster box for a second. Let's go ahead and take a minute to appreciate this beautiful 72 Ford Maverick Grabber. Not a lot left these days that aren't all beat up. This was the poor man's Mustang back in the day. And you can see why. Look at that, baby. A nice little 302 in there. This car is a lot of fun. So we showed you this thing is an absolute beast. Let's go ahead and cover a couple other little things as well. Number one, want to know how much more juice you got left in the kitty? Hit that status button right there. As you can see, we're a little low. Number two, get your nice DC 12 volt socket outlet right there so you can charge something else if you need to. Number three, you'll see that charge complete button right there. That turns green, you know it's fully loaded. And how do you charge this thing? Well, you get this little port right here and then they give you a nice wall outlet. It doesn't take long at all. So there you go, kids. There's a full field test and demo of the Booster Pack ES5000. Now, what I love about this thing is it just lives in my truck or toolbox, hot weather, cold weather, doesn't matter. I haven't charged this thing in over a year and it still comes through on the clutch. Even if you've got one dot on this thing, I bet you it still jumps what you're trying to jump. It's for those reasons and more, I easily give this thing a world's greatest dad thumbs up. And I say, what are you waiting for? Go out and get you one.